and back again <laughs> to do a video on how I create the designs to go on volleyballs this time. Um, out of all the all of them, volleyball and soccer balls are the easiest to do. So I'm gonna do try to do a couple things here. Um, show you a couple show you a couple different ways to do it. All right, let's jump right into it. Um, as you can see, big bold letters. You do your own measuring. Uh, I got it here, and the bleed area, or the design area that I'm basically going to use is uh, seven and a half by five and a quarter. But like I said, this is me buying a ball from Walmart, and. They say that they're regulation, but I don't really know. Regulation size balls is made by Franklin, and it says on uh, super soft spike. So, when I do a video on how I uh, put it on the ball, you'll see exactly which one I'm using. So that was the dimensions that I got. So I'm gonna delete this out of the back because we don't need it. And of course, as always, the green area is the safe area. We're going to slide that out the way. We're going to release compound path on the other piece and toss that away. We don't need that. Delete that. And so now we're here. Okay. Uh, as always, we want to make sure most important stuff fits right here in the green area. It can go outside the green area, the, the green, but the green area is just to make sure that we don't cut off anything, we don't lose anything, so on and so forth. Um, okay. So first, I'm gonna duplicate this yellow one in the back. And we're just gonna, the first design I'm gonna do, and you see I have this picture right here, and it's very, very simple. We're gonna enlarge it, send it to the back, and we're just gonna crop it. We're just gonna crop the picture right out, you know, just knock that right out. Somebody has a picture like this, they crop it out, boom. If they're doing just one panel on the ball, you're pretty much done. That's it. It's printed. That's it. And if you have a couple of those team photos like that and you want to put them on there, I think on the volleyball you have like one, two, three, four, five, six. I think you have about six places to put pictures if you want to cover the whole thing. I never do. To me, it's kind of tacky. Usually I do um, um, one on the front, or I do uh, on the front where it says Franken soft spike. I usually cover the whole area, um, and I may do one on the back. It's kind of the, to me that's kind of the best looking way because if you look at the top, it kind of goes a different direction across the top and on the bottom. It just goes all different sorts of ways on it, so I really just try to keep it down if they want me to cover the whole ball i will cover the entire ball but usually i try to keep it down to two two spaces okay so like i said that one is done okay so what if they want me to be really graphic and they give me this picture and they want it on there and they want something cool you know with this picture on it so i gotta do some work so uh I would start by tracing this and you'll see when I do it because it kind of looks like her doing the exact same thing so let me trace trace it all right we don't need this anymore delete that and then I would let's make it gray and let's get rid of the lines Gray. Let's get a cute background. Merge. I'm gonna use that too. I think I want to use that. I think I got her in there already. Okay, I'll come back to that. But let's let's go to backgrounds. 
Let's find something good in here. I come in here so much you guys probably know what all my backgrounds look like now. kind of like that one I was looking at in the beginning but that one looks good too it goes with her okay so let's do the lime green and the, and the blue send it to the back and I want a good chunk of that lime green so I'm gonna do that and slide it in let's crop Ooh, they're so pretty. Okay. Immediately, I'm going to start by putting um, this in here. Mm. We're going to see. We got to see how this is going to look. I may flip it the other way and then kind of. You see that? You see how she that? Yeah. Now you see where I'm going with it? lip horizontally and then look at this wait she's behind it bring it to the front you want to bring in the front of it you see it oh yeah that's so awesome that's so awesome I love it I love it What else was that? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Um, it is five o'clock in the morning. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to yell. <laughs> but it's five o'clock in the morning, and I was oh, doing a video. Wow. Of course, everybody knows to sleep. I'm up. So, um, what else would I add? I probably would add uh, words. I probably would add something. Uh, Catchy, cool. Let's listen. Let's see. Find some K. Okay. I like this strong syrup, dig fierce, spike hard. I like that. So let's do that one. What are we? Um, I do this so you guys can see. I'm just setting it up right now. And serve strong, dig fierce. Then we're gonna go back and change the fonts and make it. Make it. Um, what am I doing? <gasps> okay. Spike hard. Okay. Then we're gonna, we're gonna jazz up the words because the words are gonna be the next. Be the like. Be the next focal point, right? Okay, I'm going to lock all this together, so nothing really moves. All right, so let's start with Serve Strong. Let's find a good font for it. Ooh, I like that. You gotta give something real fierce looking. Fierce. Something that make it look fierce. The one I clicked was not it. <laughs> okay. I like Chiller. I like that one a little bit. 
just a little bit. I may be able to find something a little bit better, but I'm liking that. Ooh, can't make out what it's saying. Uh, ooh. None of these are good. None of these that I'm picking are good. I think this is the like this is the hardest part to be honest with you with um, designing is me just deciding what font I'm gonna use. I kind of like that one. I kind of like it. But I need something that looks fierce. That's just not giving me what I'm what I'm looking for. I'm getting close, but I I kind of I'm sitting in that one. That one's looking like it's gonna be a winner. Oh uh, yeah. Find anything else I like, huh? Let's see what's this here. Nope. Mm. Nope. Nope. Nobody, nope, nope, nope. So what we got is what we're going to use. A spike hard needs to be bold and strong. Because it's, you know, because that's what it's saying. You know, it got to be bold. Something bold and I like that. Right there. Okay. Just got to try a couple more before I just... on that mm. Mm -mm -mm. I kind of like that one but no Maybe it's because, yeah, that's the one. This is the one right here. This is the one. What? Or this one? Okay, let's go with that one. All right, let's zoom in a little bit. So let's. All right, because we grouped her together. So let's move her back this way. started let's bring in um, some color definitely need that let's do an offset drop the offset down to fit it just a little bit closer group it together and let's find let's think of let's decide on what would make it Stand off strong. Let's get that one out of there because it makes it hard. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. So let's leave it like that. Let's leave it there. Do fierce. I'm feeling red. I'm feeling red. This is going to be the way to go. 
but that red is just not a good red and then you then you can't change the contrast on it you can't make it darker or anything you can't make it brighter it's kind of like color red that it is Ugh. okay there go a good red better it's a shame that I gotta go find the color red to make this look good we'll do this offset just a little bit bigger let's find what are we gonna put behind it too much for me. And it may just be because it's so thick. Okay. We're going to do something else with this, so don't worry. Don't worry. We're going to We're going to do something else. And then offset this It's going to be the right radius. I want all of that. Okay. And I know you're wondering, like, why is it like this? Okay. So, of course, my favorite thing to do is to, um, okay, hold on, guys. I think I see something else I want to add. I forgot I had her up there. Ooh, forgot. All right. Let's set this off to the side. Let me do this. doing the little she's doing the dig and I want her in there so serve strong scoop it together dig fierce Now let me show you why I did that. Okay. You know my favorite thing to do is to use Photoshop to bevel my uh, to bevel my fonts. So I'm gonna paste them here. Oh, delete. Too many. volleyball folder so let me put it in there just call it words png and then let's go in let's go in photoshop file new and that is the size and create and let's ball and then go in here and just slide this in there drag and drop and then of course blending options bevel and emboss all 
I like everything with the fierce. It looks like my, and it may not look like that on a darker background, but. Hmm, let's get in here. So can we change it? Get the light, uh, get the light to shine from a different, cause it's making the light shine from a different angle. So we just need to do that. And then it'll give us a little bit more We just gonna bevel everything. I wish I had given me a little bit more bevel on the spike hard, on the black part, but I guess we'll, we'll see what it looks like. it and okay so let's go back to and let's see how it looks I'll merge words I like it I like it Okay, so yeah, I like it just the way that it is. Okay, yeah, I like it like that. What, uh, let me see, what are the. Everything always look better with lightning bolts. I'm sorry, you guys. I know I, I stick lightning in everything, but I like lightning and I got the blue. This is gonna be, this is about to be amazing. Okay, so we gotta do this thing. We gotta do a thing here. Well, well let's not mess up that one. Let's duplicate this one and mess this one up. <laughs> okay. Let's do a thing here. I want it to be rounded off on all the ends so it looks it looks right okay it didn't do it it didn't I didn't do it right I'm just gonna grab both of them make sure you grab both of them and there it is so okay group all of this and then set that there like so but I may have to bring down the opacity on this yeah group and then send to the back to the back. Now that I see this, I should have brought it all the way down. Or I need to do this. Okay, so let's do it again. Because now that I see it, good bring 
going to the front. This time I'm going to stretch it all the way up and all the way down. So it fits perfectly in that space. And it looks like it's all supposed to be there. So yeah, you divide it and now we pull it out and now we put it in. And now um, we drop the opacity on it without taking too much away. And we group this together and then we gotta put it all back together. Sorry, we gotta put it all back together. really good with her right there bring it to the front and then we add our words back And then that's it. That's it. That's what we do to uh, create the design for the volleyball. Same thing. Same thing we've been doing with all the other ones. Just a lot of layering. Just a lot of adding different components. And then you create whatever your customer needs you to create. And that you use a little bit of Photoshop. A little bit of Silhouette um, Studio. And you create this really dynamic design that you can use on your balls not really hard uh, to do um, thank you guys for sticking around with me and uh, watching another video I will again uh, as I as with all the um, sport balls videos I will post a video of me actually putting the design on the ball so stay tuned for that until next time